Hey there everyone, this is Portman973, and I am still here having a blast playing Stanley's Parable. See, I remembered it. Stanley knew the office layout like the back of his hand. Shut up! It was only a matter of time before he found the others, wherever they were. Just a matter of time. Did he say something different? Coffee! When Stanley came to a set of two open doors, he entered the door on his left. Here, how... Uh, wait. Go on the door on the right. This was not the correct way to the meeting room, and Stanley knew it perfectly well. Perhaps he wanted to stop by the employee lounge first, just to admire it. It's a very nice looking room. Wow. Yes. This room. What a beautiful room. What a gorgeous, gorgeous room. Thank goodness Stanley had taken this detour on his way to the meeting room. Life without having experienced this room was now too horrible even to consider. Yeah. I would have been sad. And I'm too happy to be sad right now. To get back to business, Stanley took the first open door on his left. No. I won't. Stanley was so bad at following directions, it's incredible he wasn't fired years ago. Look, Stanley, I think perhaps we've gotten off on the wrong foot here. Nope. I'm not your enemy, really, I'm not. I realize that investing in your trust in someone else can be difficult, but the fact is that the story has been about nothing but you all this time. Yeah. There's someone you've been neglecting, Stanley. No. Uh -uh. Someone you've forgotten about. What? Really? Yeah. I was in the middle of something. Do you have zero consideration for others? Yeah. Are you that convinced that I want something bad to happen to you? Why, I don't know how to convince you of this, but I really do want to help you, to show you something beautiful. Look, let me prove it. Let me prove that I'm on your side. Give me a chance. Okay. Got, now oh. listen carefully, this is important. Stanley walked through the red door. Okay, walk through the blue door. Aha, perhaps you misunderstood. Stanley walked through the red door. I'm colorblind, so red door. I still don't think we're communicating properly. Stanley walked through the red door. I don't understand why you're pointing at the blue door. This is obviously the red door. Obviously, you want me to go through the blue door. I'm not really colorblind. I'm just joking. Oh, it's, there's an arrow. Want to go through the red door over there? But the arrow that's calling me. No! Oh, thank God, you are willing to listen to me. Do you see that I really have wanted you to be happy all this time? The problem is all these choices. The two of us always trying to get somewhere that isn't here. Running and running and running, just the way you're doing right now. Don't you see that it's killing us, Stanley? I just... I want it to stop. I would... We would both be so much happier if we just... Stopped. And I think... Well, I think I have a solution. Here, let me show you. I like that door. Wait a minute. Wait a minute! What happened to the hallway? Fine. Hmm. What do we want? What are we looking for? Hmm? Stars? Where am I, a spaceship? If we just stay right here, right in this moment, with this place, Stanley, I think I feel happy. I actually feel happy. <laughs> I'm glad, Mr. Narrator. But I don't like the way all these things are commu are just kind of getting together. And it was fascinating at first, 
But it's getting awful bright. Let's get out of here. No, wait. Where are you going? Where are, we, where are those things? Right. Where were we? Fascinating, but I'm done. Got anything else new for me? Hey! Green stuff! This is all changing. Nope, stay angry, so. Okay. Oh no! Stay away from those stairs! If you hurt yourself, if you die, the game will reset! We'll oh. lose all of this! Hmm. So I go back this way, will you be happy? Back to the green goo? Too safe. Promise me you won't go back there. Hmm? Just, just stay here. It's boring in here, Mr. Narrator. No. What do we talk about? You're risking everything we achieved here. Hey, it's red stuff now. Are you? You are going to stay here, aren't you? Sure. No. Gonna go up those stairs. You heard me before, didn't you? You will die. What about this? Isn't getting through to you? I don't know. I like stairs. Look at these great stairs. They're like up and stuff. Please, no, Stanley. Let me stay here. Don't take this from me. I'm sorry, Mr. Narrator guy, but I have to continue the game. Let me think about what you're doing. Okay, I'll, I'll stay here and think. I'll give you five seconds. Five, four, three, two, one. You ever give me a good reason? Bye! Oh, oh thank God you lived. You had me worried there for a moment. Now. Can we please get back to the other room? No! Back on the stairs! No. No, no. What are you doing, Stanley? Please, I'm asking you not to take this away from me. I can't go back to what I was before. If you die, we'll both go back. Why are you doing this? Okay, Mr. Narrator Man. I'll go back to the other room. For you. There. See? This is what you want. This is where we can both be happy. We really can. If we stop moving, we just have to stop moving. I'm bored! This room is boring! I'm going back up the stairs! Go back. There's nothing good that can come from this. I'm bored. I'm going to go up the stairs. Do you just not believe me? What can I say to convince you? Open this door! Get me another door, and I'll stop. Five seconds! Five, one! Stanley, let's go back to the other room. Can you do that for me? No. No. No, Mr. Narrator, you're... Really how much you dislike my game? That you'll throw yourself from this platform over and over to be rid of it? You are literally willing to kill yourself to keep me from being happy. Am I reading the situation correctly? Don't get me wrong, Mr. Narrator, man. I like your game a lot, and I want you to be happy, but I can't be stuck in this room while I'm recording. Turn out! Maybe you're just getting a kick out of it. I don't know anymore. I just wanted us to get along. 
But I guess that was too much to ask. Oh. It looks like you wanted to make a choice after all. Well, this one is yours. We'll go back to the room, Mr. Nero. Do you actually want to stay alive? Or are you just teasing me? Here we go, Mr. Narrator Man. I wanted us to be happy here, Stanley. I really did. I wish I still thought that was possible. See, Mr. Narrator Man, all's good. All's good. I've only broke some, you know, hairline fractures in both my legs and my lower back. It's okay. It's okay, Mr. Narrator. But this is still getting boring. I'm giving you glimpses, you know? Make sure you're happy, Mr. Narrator Man. I want you to be happy. But me walking around a room isn't very fun. So, I'm sorry, Mr. Narrator Man. Going to restart, isn't it? Yeah. I'm going back. Poor Mr. Narrator Man. But anyway, I got out of that room! Yay! Oh, this is amazing! I love this game! So many choices, so many narrations! It's so funny! To do it more! Ah! This is a poor man 973, and I hope you all have a great day.